first stop on our tasty adventure is at the Pearl for some house-made pasta and gigantic chicken parmesan. Let's go inside Arosta. Joining us now is executive chef and partner Robbie Nolan out here. Thank you so much for having us. Thank you for coming by. Everything looks fantastic. I mean, you got some desserts, you got some savory options, some starters. How did all of this get started here at the restaurant? It's about Italian flair with Texas love. That's really what it's about. So we're just excited to be able to showcase this to San Antonio and the community as a whole. Talk to me about what's going on right here. This is like a starter bread, right? It is. So this is focaccia di Recco. The inspiration comes from the town of Recco, which is next to Genoa. It's like a very, very thin, sort of a lavash style bread, unleavened inside is like a fermented mozzarella. So it's very, very delicious. Honey, fresh oregano, and sea salt. We're going in. Let's do it. I'm Cheers. sold. Cheers. Boom. That's the bite. Give me some love. No. No. The focaccia bread is beautiful. It's so tender on the inside, on the outside. You have a little bit of crispiness on there as well. It has good character. You have some of the cheese on there, a little bit of those aromatic flavors as well. It is a great bite and a great way to start your meal. You also have some scratch-made pastas on the menu, and we have one right here. Talk to me about this. So spinach rigatoni. We take baby arrow leaf spinach, blanch it, make a puree, mix it with some Molina flour, and we come out with this really cool textured dough. Sauce, vodka, tomato paste, caramelized onions. On top, we cook the salata, a little bit of parsley. I'm Boom. excited for this. Cheers. Cheers. Boom. Right. Whoa. There are a variety of scratch-made pastas on the menu, and the spinach rigatoni is by far one of the tastiest ones you can try. That sauce on there, oh my gosh, it has that little bit of zing to it on there, a little bit of spice, and then you have all the cheese on top, that creaminess from the ricotta that's on there as well. You mix that all together, you get some of that spinach from the pasta itself, and it is absolutely delicious. You all get real crazy. We're talking Texas style. Yeah. Talk to me about this chicken parmesan because that's the biggest chicken parmesan I've ever seen in my life. So we're excited about chicken parmesan. So we do it a little bit differently here. We do a beer batter. So we use Shiner Bach beer and we create like a flour. We go in flour into a beer batter, back into flour. So it's a little bit like a bread press, but almost like a beer batter as well. And it's <laughs> massive. It's a 16 ounce Yo, portion. It's gnarly. That is insane. Yeah. That is a big piece of chicken. Mozzarella melted on top, San Marzano tomato sauce on the bottom. And look at the inside, just beautiful. Yep, boom, and cheers. cheers. Oh wow. Yeah, baby. That's yeah. a double fist bump. That is incredible. Thank you. Mm. This is by far one of the largest chicken parmesans I've ever seen in my life. That's like Texas style, right? But it's a chicken parmesan, so you have all that beautiful tomato sauce on there as well. So you have some of the acidity coming off of that all that cheese on there. You have all that stringy, melty cheese as well. And then the crust on the outside, super light and delicate, made with Schinerbach beer. I mean, it's so different, it's so good. And then that brine chicken on the inside is super tender. Definitely the dish you gotta try. You gotta save room because there's so much more on the menu. But talk to me about this dessert right here. It looks so beautiful. You did a great job. Thank you. <laughs> Hazelnut chocolate cake. So our inspiration behind this was like Matilda, the movie, right? Like this is like really, really moist, rich, dark chocolate cake. But then the mousse that's layered between is obviously Nutella. So hazelnut, the Italian spread that we all have in our pantries. And then milk gelato, rather. So a gelato creamy, but milk only, no vanilla. And we're letting the chocolate shine on this one. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. This is where it's at, y'all. Chef Robbie is doing a great job with the Rosta. And I love all the different items that you have on the menu and available to people all throughout the day. And I tell you what, you gotta save room for these cakes and all the desserts that they have. These things are just rocking. Arosta, over here by the Pearl, you have to come check them out. Thank you for having us. Thank you. And also there's pastries, you can grab an espresso, come enjoy yourself. Feels yeah. like you're in like Europe. It feels very European in here. Beautiful. And you just wanna stop in and just relax. Boom. There we go. Great job. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button. And if you want to get notifications on new videos about restaurants from across the Lone Star State, make sure to hit that subscribe button.